God's mercy and absolution. Well, think about that reality. Why does the confessional exist? It exists because God wants friendship restored when it's broken. And so when we choose to sin, we choose to reject God. We've chosen to reject his friendship. I like a book that was recently written by uh, John Cudaback, and Father Mark did an interview about this book called True Friendship. Well, the reason I want to talk about friendship today is because our Lord mentions being his friends three times in today's gospel. And he says, no one has greater love than this than to lay down one's life for one's friends. You are my friends if you do what I command you. I have called you friends because I have told you everything I have heard from my father. So he's calling us to this friendship. And I like what John Cudaback says in this book, True Friendship. He says that really the ancients, Socrates, Plato, Aristotle, these ancient Greek philosophers before the time of Christ, that just using human reason, they saw that, that we desire friendship and we need friendship. And it's necessary for our own happiness. But that it's also necessary to be enabled to have friendship, to be virtuous. So that virtue enables us to have more friendships and deeper friendships. So John gives an example in this book about these two girls who had known each other since kindergarten, since they were little girls. They'd always been close friends. And they got in a car accident because they had been at a party, they had been drinking. And so the girl who was driving, driving her, her, her parents' car, had made a promise to her father that she would never drink and drive. Well, her friend says to her after they get in this accident, now you have to lie to your father. Because if you don't, then my father's going to find out and I'll be in trouble too. So you, have to, you just have to lie that we weren't at a party, we weren't drinking, and that's not the cause of the accident. So this is just a, a story he's giving to illustrate the fact that, and then this girl says, and if you don't, our friendship is over. So he's illustrating this is not really a true friendship, is it? Because friendship is something that's rooted in virtue, that we want to help each other to grow in virtue, to grow in holiness, to grow in the life of God. And then those friendships are deep and lasting, and it opens us up to more friendships and a deeper friendship with each other. So friendship, you know, it's said there's three ways that friendship helps us in this life. So what John Cudaback is saying here is that virtue is necessary. In fact, they're, they're so related for, to enable us to be friends and to have deep friendships and lasting friendships that will last into eternity in the communion of the saints. So what are some of the fruits of friendship? It satisfies the heart. We cannot live a self-centered life without feeling we're missing the true glory of life. No one would care to live without friends, even if he had all other good things. I think that was Socrates or Aristotle said that. No one would care to live without friends, even if he had all other good things. And so it's a sin really against ourselves not to cultivate friendships. Second, friendship assists our judgment. We rarely feel confident until we have an agreement with others that we trust. It brings about a satisfaction of the mind. Sometimes we've got 
serious questions in our life. We'll want to bounce them off of somebody who cares about us, who wants our good. And when we do that, it satisfies our mind if they say, yeah, I think you're doing the right thing, or, well, maybe you should do this or think about this. So it assists us in our judgment. Just talking things over gives us fresh lights, new avenues, and just having a sympathetic listener helps in itself. Third, friendship helps you in life's difficulties. It gives strength to the character, just knowing that if we fall, others will help to lift us up as a great comfort. The fight is not so hard when we know that we are not alone. But as good and beautiful and necessary as human friendship is, it is always by its nature limited, partial, and in danger of ending. You know, the founder of the Poor Clares of Perpetual Adoration, Mother Maria of St. Clair, so that was the order Mother Angelica belonged to. They were founded in 1854. And she had had some disappointments, I think, in guys that were courting her. And so she finally decided, she said, I want a heart that I can't be separated from in life or in death. And so she's decided to give her life totally to the Lord. Now, as I said, choosing the Lord doesn't eliminate other friendships and deep marital love. In fact, it only enhances it. So our human heart craves for a relationship deeper and more lasting than any possible among people, undisturbed by change, unmenaced by death, unclouded by doubt. We don't have that in our friendship with the Lord. The losses, in fact, of earthly friendship are meant to drive us to a higher friendship with him. The loneliness or grief that not even the voice of a friend can dispel compels us to the divine friend, to Jesus. True religion is about communion, union with God. That's what we recall our reception today of the Eucharist. We call it a holy communion, a union with him. He offers, we offer him ourselves. He takes us as his friends. I no longer call you servants or slaves. I call you my friends. And friends reveal the deepest things to one another. And Jesus said, I've told you everything I've heard from the Father. And we can unload our hearts, open our hearts. And I often recommend that when you're heavily laden, go wherever the tabernacle is. Unload your heart before your true friend, your deep friend, Jesus. So this, as I said, this friendship with Christ enhances and increases the number of our friends and the true force of them. The person who lives with Jesus knows him to be a lover who cleaves closer than a brother, a friend who loves at all times and is there in adversity. And I just conclude with this little writing which was entitled, This is My Friend, which I think is a beautiful way to uh, conclude this. To be called friends by our master, to know him as the lover of our souls, to give him entrance to our hearts, is to learn the meaning of living and to experience the ecstasy of living. This higher friendship is bestowed without price. Tis only heaven that is given away. Tis only God may be had for the asking.
Let us keep our eyes fixed on Jesus, our true friend, as we offer our petitions before the throne of God. For the church, that she may be united in harmony, peace, mutual forgiveness, and reconciliation. We pray to the Lord. That the gifts of the spirit of wisdom and counsel be given to our Holy Father, who has been entrusted with the keys of the kingdom as the successor of St. Peter. We pray to the Lord. Lord That we may unite all our choices with the will of God and so find our true freedom and fulfillment. We pray to the Lord. Lord That those who have died may experience the fullness of God's forgiveness and peace. We pray to the Lord. Lord, we pray, give us a love for what you command and a longing for what you promise, so that amid this world's changes, our hearts may be set on the world of lasting joy. Through Christ our Lord. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his Receive, O Lord, we pray, the offerings placed on your altar in commemoration of blessed Leopold Mondic, so that as you brought him glory, you may through these sacred mysteries grant to us your pardon. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit, lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks. 
Lord, Holy Father, almighty and eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For as on the festival of Saint Leopold, you bid your church rejoice, so to you strengthen her by the example of his holy life. Teach her by his words of preaching and keep her safe in answer to his prayers. And so with the company of angels and saints, we sing the hymn of your praise as without end we acclaim. indeed holy, O Lord, and all you have created rightly gives you praise. For through your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, by the power and working of the Holy Spirit, you give life to all things and make them holy. And you never cease to gather a people to yourself, so that from the rising of the sun to its setting, a pure sacrifice may be offered to your name. Therefore, O Lord, we humbly implore you by the same Spirit, graciously make holy these gifts we have brought to you for consecration, that they may become the body and blood of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, at whose command we celebrate these mysteries. From the night he was betrayed, he himself took bread, and giving you thanks, he said the blessing, broke the bread, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and giving you thanks, he said the blessing and gave the chalice to his disciples saying, take this all of you and drink from it for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Mysterium Fidei. Mortem Tua, Magnus Iamus Domine, et Tua Resurrectionem Confitemur, Donec Venias. Therefore, O Lord, as we celebrate the memorial of the saving passion of your Son, his wondrous resurrection and ascension into heaven. And as we look forward to his second coming, we offer you in thanksgiving this holy and living sacrifice. Look, we pray upon the oblation of your church and recognizing the sacrificial victim by whose death you will to reconcile us to yourself. 
Grant that we who are nourished by the body and blood of your Son and filled with this Holy Spirit may become one body, one spirit in Christ. May he make of us an eternal offering to you so that we may obtain an inheritance with your elect, especially with the most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with blessed Joseph, her spouse, with your blessed apostles and glorious martyrs, with Saint Leopold Mondich, and with all the saints on whose constant intercession in your presence we rely for unfailing help. May this sacrifice of our reconciliation, we pray, O Lord, advance the peace and salvation of all the world. Be pleased to confirm in faith and charity your pilgrim church on earth with your servant, Francis, our Pope, and Stephen, our Bishop, the Order of Bishops, all the clergy, and the entire people you have gained for your own. Listen graciously to the prayers of this family whom you have summoned before you. In your compassion, O merciful Father, gather to yourself all your children scattered throughout the world. To our departed brothers and sisters and to all who are pleasing to you at their passing from this life, give kind admittance to your kingdom. There we hope to enjoy forever the fullness of your glory through Christ our Lord, through whom you bestow on the world all that is good. Through him and with him and in him, O God, almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Precepti salutari bus moniti et divina institutione formati aude musti dicere. Pater vostem, qui es in celis, sanctificetur nomen tuum, adveniat regnum tuum, fiat voluntas tua, Sicut in cielo et in terra, Panem nostrum quotidianum da nobis odie, Et imite nobis evita nostra, Sicut et nos imitimus debitoribus nostris, Et ne nos inducas in tentationem, sed liberanos a malo. Liberanos quesumus domine ab omnibus malis, da propitius pacem in dihibus nostris, ur ope misericordiae tu iadiuti, et a peccato simus semper liberi, et ab omni perturbatione securi, expectantes beatum spem, et adventum salvatoris nostri, Iesu Christi. Iesu Christe, quid existe apostolis tuis, pacem renen quo vobis, pacem meum do vobis. Ne despicias pecata nostra, sed fidem ecclesiae tuae, eam quae secundum volotatem tuam pacificare e coadernare dignaris. Qui vivis ad regnas in secula seculorum. Sit semper vobis cum.
Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but I only say the word and my soul shall be This is the steward, faithful and prudent, whom the Lord set over his household to give them their allowance of food at the proper time. Alleluia. For those who cannot now receive Jesus in the Blessed Sacrament, we offer the following prayer. My Jesus, I believe that thou art present in the Blessed Sacrament. I love thee above all things, and I desire thee in my soul. Since I cannot now receive thee sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. As though thou wert already there, I embrace thee and unite myself wholly to thee. Permit me not that I should ever be separated from thee. Amen. Oh, 
Let us pray. May partaking at the heavenly table, almighty God, confirm and increase strength from on high in all who celebrate the feast day of blessed Leopold, that we may preserve in integrity the gift of faith and walk in the path of salvation you trace for us. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Dominus Vobiscum. Ergum Benedicat vos omnipotens Deus, Pater et Filius et Spiritus Sanctus. Amen. Et
for vocations. God our Father, who wills that all men be saved and come to the knowledge of your truth, we beg you to send laborers into your harvest and grant them grace to speak your word with all boldness, so that your word may spread and be glorified, and all nations may know you, the only God, and him whom you have sent. I gave a talk recently, and an older man with a walker approached me afterwards. I think maybe he had a stroke, but he was still strong and full of life, and his eyes lit up as he started to give me some unsolicited parenting advice. He said, I have four girls, and on their fifth birthday, I, I used to pull up in my antique car, ring the bell, bring him flowers, and take him out on a date. And tears started streaming down his face when he told me, and when I turned 50, they all came to my door with flowers and took their dad out on a date. Dads, it doesn't take much investment to make your kids feel so special. I mean, anything from a regular ice cream date to asking how her day was and listening to the answer, it doesn't take much, but it does take this, focused one-on-one -on -one time. And you might regret a whole lot of things when you look back at your life when you're older. But there's one thing I can absolutely promise you you will not regret, and it's wasting time and attention and focus on your kids. EWTN invites you to join us in this rosary as we pray for peace in Ukraine. During this month, we beg the Holy Spirit to come and renew the face of the earth and to grant everyone light from above, purification from sin, comfort in our distress, spiritual gifts for unity and peace, and to pour the love of God into our hearts. Come, Holy Spirit, come and renew the face of the earth. Together, come Holy Spirit, Creator, come from your bright heavenly throne. Come take possession of our souls and make them all your own. You who are called the paraclete, best gift of God above, the living spring, the living fire, sweet unction and true love. You who are sevenfold in your grace, finger of God's right hand, his promise teaching little ones to speak and understand. O oh, guide our minds with your blessed light, with love our hearts inflame, and with your strength which never decays, confirm our mortal frame. Far from us drive our hellish foe, true peace unto us bring. And through all perils, guide us safe beneath your sacred wing. Through you may we the Father know, through you the Eternal Son, and you the Spirit of them both, thrice blessed three in one. 
All glory to the Father be, and to the risen Son, the same to you, O Paraclete, while endless ages run. Amen. The Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Sorrowful Mysteries. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy God of the Church, the communion of sins, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For an increase in the virtues of faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. And it was in the beginning, it is now and ever shall be, world without end. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony of Jesus in the garden. And Jesus came out and went, as was his custom, to the Mount of Olives. And the disciples followed him. And when he came to the place, he said to them, Pray that you may not enter into temptation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. And as it well was in the beginning, it is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging of Jesus at the pillar. Pilate said to them, after examining him before you, behold, I did not find this man guilty of any of the charges against him. Neither did Herod, for he sent him back to us. Behold, nothing deserving death has been done by him. I will therefore chastise him and release him. But they all cried out together, away with this man. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. And as it was in the beginning, it is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy.
the third sorrowful mystery, the crowning of Jesus with thorns. Now the men who were holding Jesus mocked him and beat him. They also blindfolded him and asked him, prophesy, who is it that struck you? And they spoke many other words against him, reviling him. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. And as it was in the beginning, it is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery, Jesus carries the cross. And there followed him a great multitude of the people and of women who bewailed and lamented him. But Jesus, turning to them, said, Daughters of Jerusalem, do not weep for me, but weep for yourselves and for your children. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fifth sorrowful mystery, Jesus is crucified and dies on the cross. It was now about the sixth hour, and there was darkness over the whole land until the ninth hour, while the sun's light failed. And the curtain in the temple was torn in two. Then Jesus, crying with a loud voice, said, Father, into your hands I commit my spirit. And having said this, he breathed his last. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. And as it was in the beginning, it is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. Show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. For our Holy Father's intentions, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. As we believe those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, the Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O Mary, conceived without sin. Pray for us in our worship. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, bless our family, all of us now together, those far away, all who are gone back to you. May we know joy, may we bear our sorrows in patience. Let love guide our understanding of each other, let us be grateful to each other. 
we have all made each other what we are. O family of Jesus, 